Hello everybody and welcome back to Terra Incognita with Steely Rin. We are going to jump into North Willow and see if we can find some work to get better gear before we try out this next mission. Um, well, <laughs> over a hundred years ago. Wow, so this place has been here for a little while. If it's only gotten this far in the building, I feel like it's been attacked a lot. Ooh, are you like a Felgen? I'm trying to get into the Willow Guard. Not many Felgen around the north anymore. Heck, <laughs> I was lucky to stumble across North Willow. That is really cool. That is a really cool race. That's not something you see very typically in fantasy. Or at least I don't feel that you do. You want to upgrade some of your equipment? Yeah, let's see if I can. Okay, I'm going to upgrade swords and bows that you have equipped. Don't bother bringing me magic gear. I wouldn't know what to do with that sort of thing. Uh, let's work on Alexis's weapon. You have Fallen Sword Crypt. Wanna, wow, I don't know if I have that much money, do I? How much? 915. Oh, okay, well, I can afford that sword upgrade, so let's do it. Okay, cool. Don't forget to re-equip it. Okay. Uh, weapons. Uh, okay, how do I... Uh, let's see. Alexis, let's see. I'll figure it out in a second. I promise. <laughs> Gear for Alexis. Change the weapon. There we go. Okay. Okay, so now we're going to walk and talk and find jobs. Some potions have random abilities, you know. It's true. Nobody has a clue what's going to happen when you drink one of those things. Be careful when you drink them. Something awful could happen. That sounds fun. Okay, that dude's not going to talk to me. That's fine. I thought maybe in the tavern there'd be like a board with notices or something. That's pretty normal in a video game. Um, okay, that's the exit to the town. That's the camp. Let's see. Willow Tavern. Let's go in this tavern and see. Hey, do you need something? Um, I guess not. What about you? You're an elf, I think. You know, this town was founded by humans and elf folk. Dwarves are everywhere these days. I need another drink. <laughs> Is that a very light hint at some prejudice going on? Uh, can I talk to you? Hey, I'm stuffed. I had too much cake. Here, just take this last slice of cake. I can't even look at it. Well, thank you. I wanted some cake. Welcome to the Willow Tavern. We serve beer. Yes, you... Okay. Sit down. Have a beer. Too busy. Uh, you gonna buy me a drink? You're not that attractive. <laughs> wow. That was mean of me. <laughs> it's a good thing that's just a virtual character. Oh... Let's see, what about this person? This person could maybe... Do you want some help with something? Like, do you want us to go gather ingredients? Can I help you? You know, it's rude to just walk into people's homes. I will go, like, slice a werewolf's jaw out and give you teeth from a werewolf. That's worth money, right? Werewolf teeth and potions? Just a thought. You should consider that. Um... Let's walk into this person's house. We shouldn't just walk into... <laughs> you did it just a second ago. What's wrong with it now? Uh... Okay, what about you? Since me a strange the mayor comes out of the manor. I've lived in North Willow for three years and only seen a few times at town meetings. That is odd. Good day to you. Can I walk in here? Do you care? I... Okay, I can't. Can't find that? No. Okay. What's up here? What's up? You can't come in, you know. Now buzz off. Ah, oh, well, thanks. <laughs> oh, that's very nice of you. Let's see if the baker wants us to do anything. Love coming here. If I hang around long enough, sometimes the baker gives me free cake. Oh my god, that sounds awesome. These days, everyone wants sugary cakes. They'll rot your teeth, you know. Eh, every once in a while it won't. You looking for work? Yes. Good. The name's Kev. Nice to meet you. You see, I own this place, and I'm having a few, well, donut issues. <laughs> donut issues? They look pretty good to me, so what can we do to help? Yes, yes, you can help. You see, someone is pinching my donuts. Every morning I'm down on donuts. Some days it's 10, some days they completely clear me out. Well, 
If it keeps up at this rate, I'll be out of business. Dang. Well, that's the thing. I walk up every night. Someone must be sneaking in somehow. I need you to find out who and stop them. We're on it. Do you have any other evidence that could help us catch the thief? I'm afraid not, but I have been finding large piles of donut crumbs around North Willow. Maybe the, the thief left a crumb trail. Okay, well, I guess we're gonna walk around and look for a crumb trail. I hope we don't have to wait till like the next day or something silly like that. Hey, what's up? Just wait here a sec. What? Is that on your head? There's a mystery to be... Oh my god, Leon's a dork. Uh, this must be a job for... Leon, mystery solver extraordinaire. Oh god. You've got to be kidding me. They've even cut the music in the background to match. Oh no. With me on the case, we'll find this donut thief in no time. Let's get on it. Okay. Let's question some of the townsfolk. We might be able to get some info on this donut thief. Oh my god. What about you, little girl? Hi! <laughs> Hi! Hi! Oh, you're not gonna talk to us about anything. What about you, dude? Have you tried the fresh cream cakes? Okay, well, I guess I'm not worried about you. Wait a minute, is that a donut sitting right there on the fountain? Aha! Someone has left donut crumbs here on the fountain. It's not this cat, is it? Oh! <laughs> it's just a little digital noise, but it's cute. Okay, okay. <laughs> what about you, dwarf? Hi! I haven't seen you in North Moon before. Okay, it wasn't you. I can't go to the mayor's house. Is this person? No, this house is empty. I don't know what that's all about. Okay, well, it's on the fountain. Um, <laughs> okay. What about you, elf? Grandpa's teaching me to fish. Okay, well, you're too occupied with learning to fish to worry about donuts, I guess. Can I take that apple? I don't think I can get to it. Are you attending the town meeting? Let's walk into this little person's house. Oh, hi, I haven't met you. Hi there. You like the painting, huh? It's okay, I guess. Okay. This is the last painting by the famous Ferratus Gabriel. He painted this day. Painted this the day before he disappeared. Legend has it that he's still out there somewhere, driven mad by his desire for perfection. Oh, that's odd. I'm getting nowhere on this donut quest. Let's look around for more eating donuts? Question mark? be funny if it was like a town guard that just couldn't get enough, couldn't get enough donut. We will get back to the fighting soon. I just want enough gold to upgrade at least weapons for each of them. Oh, <laughs> I'm such a loser. Uh... Anything in the anvil here? Any half-eaten donuts? No, nothing. Alright y'all, be just a little patient with me. No idea what we're doing. Hi, Felgen. We just finished restoring the chapel windows. The stained glass windows are beautiful, don't you think? That actually is quite pretty. No half-eaten donuts in this chapel. I wonder what they worship. The, the Calum gods or whatever? Can I go back to Vegas again? Wow, that's a very sad graveyard. If I walked right by a donut or something and y'all saw that, you can totally yell at me in the comments if I walked right by something like four times. 
what's down here? Ooh, a jail. A very well-built jail. Why don't they use some of those bricks to build better walls or something? Anything up here? Oh, have you seen anything? I don't want to watch tonight. I hope it doesn't rain again. Uh, Maybe I'm supposed to talk to the baker again since I discovered the happy dinner. Excitement mark? Okay. Excuse me, miss. Yes. Oh, um, <clears throat> I need to ask you a few questions regarding a donut-related thief. Um, okay. Have you noticed anyone hanging around the bakery late at night or smuggling large quantities of donuts recently? I haven't, I'm afraid. I never stay out past dark. Hmm. <sighs> Okay, thanks for your time. That was useless. <sighs> now I talk to him again. I'll just tell him about the fact that there's like there was a donut sitting out there. Good luck catching that thief. Never mind. We're not going to tell him anything apparently. Okay, Leon, time for you to you know actually be good at the thing you said you were going to be good at. I think it's the cat. Have you tried the fresh cream cakes? I don't know, it might be that guy. Okay, she just said the same thing. Dang guy, okay, oh, more excitement marks, that's helpful. <clears throat> Have you noticed anyone acting suspiciously around the bakery? I did see a woman, <clears throat> I did see a woman running toward the tavern carrying cake and donuts. Aha! Thanks for your help, sir. Oh, I just gave him a very girly voice. I mean, yes? <laughs> oh, so I was right, and Leon's an idiot. <laughs> I only just arrived. Me and my sister were living in the wilderness for a few years, but the monsters are getting more aggressive. Okay, let's look for more excitement marks, because apparently that's how we play this. No. So we saw a woman running around. What would you even do to a donut thief? I don't know. I'd make them work at the bakery for like two weeks or something. No pay. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe that's a bit too cruel. Are you attending the town meeting next week? Um, is there any hint in here? Can I tell Is that key? I probably shouldn't take that even if I could. Well, crap, guys. This has been really boring so far. Well, I mean, I imagine... I'm enjoying playing the game. I'm not necessarily enjoying trying to run around figuring out who stole... How come we can walk into every other house, practically, except that one? Like... Okay, I can't walk in there either. Never mind. A woman running toward the bakery with cakes and stuff. Um... I don't know, was it you? Back in my day, a loaf of bread. No, it wasn't an old lady. She doesn't care about donuts. She just wants bread. You know, a really good multigrain bread is very tasty. Like, with all the seeds and nuts and different things in it. Man, I like, I like artisan baked bread. I've been wanting to learn how to make bread. It's very difficult. I tried making biscuits like a dozen times and I never could get them right. I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> what about you? Did you see anything? I'm running low on supplies. No, you're old. You don't care. No thanks. Was it you? Uh, this is getting nowhere. Okay. 
Uh, I'm probably going to edit this part out. This is taking way too long. I'm seriously going to edit out the entire chunk of what happened to solve this quest. Alright. Especially since it's been, what, like... Oh, it's only been like 10 minutes. That's not that bad. I am running back and forth pointlessly, though. Oh, look at that. More evidence. Donut crumbs in the tavern. I wonder what this means. I don't know, maybe the person sitting right there next to it. People here eat too many sugary treats. It means our thief could be close. Let's report back to Kev at the bakery. We can have some more info for us. I've heard at night the Soul Guild do all sorts of weird magic. But that sounds fun. Let's go do weird magic. I mean, we're already doing all kinds of crazy fire magic and healing magic. Let's do crazy magic. I have a plan. Oh, really? Let's hear it. Okay. So, we wait around until dark. If we see anyone suspicious, we grab them. That could work. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whose finger is that? Sorry. <sighs> Is Braum like one of those bro dudes? Shh, Leon. We've been in this bush for hours. Oh my god. Yeah, this is a waste of time. A good detective never gives in so quickly. What was that? Let's check it out. Da 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 I caught you, thief. You all right, Kev? He's eating on the donut. Is he eating in his sleep? Is he asleep? Wake up, huh? What happened? We found the donut thief. <laughs> Great. Well, where are they? <laughs> You've been sleep eating donuts. Man, he sounds like a really stressed dude now. Oh my, not again. Yup. So you've been eating all your own supplies in your sleep. So you're going to have to work at your own bakery for two weeks without pay. Just to catch your business up. <laughs> I'm so sorry for wasting your time. Hey, it's no problem. <laughs> that hat is awful. Another case solved by Leon, mystery solver extraordinaire. Take this. It will bring you luck. What am I doing with my life? Uh... <laughs> okay, what did, what did we get? Like, I don't understand. What did we get? Uh... Armor? A super lucky donut ring boosts fortune, dexterity, and max HP. Okay, I'm going to assume that uh, dexterity would be very good for a ranged character, because that seems to be very typical. Uh, change. Let's see. A copper ring. Aura. What does aura do? Do I, do I get any explanation on the stats? Um, let's see, does he have any rings? He has a gold ring. Oh, well, okay. Don't have a ring it is then. Hey, Braum, would you like a ring? A steel ring. Yeah, I guess not. Okay, I'm happy about that. Alright, that silly POS quest was way more than enough for this episode. I'm probably actually going to edit out some of the time it took me to run around and find the clues. So, uh, I hope everybody enjoyed that. <laughs> I tried to enjoy that. It was a little bit more slow-paced and silly than what I'm used to from this game so far. But, uh, you know, if you would like to support me, if you appreciate the content I'm putting up, I would love it if you would leave me a like, a subscribe, a comment. I will totally, you know, talk with you, comment back to you. You know, if you'd like to 
collab with me on a game. If you have a game you want to see me play, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. But uh, you know, until then, I hope y'all have a great day, and I hope to see you next. Hi everyone. Hope you enjoyed those cats in that episode of Terra Incognita. I've left some links here on this picture if you want to check out some of my other videos. Y'all have a good day.